Hi guys and welcome back to my channel or hi hello if you are new here. Today's video is a very very cosy Christmassy video so make sure you're all comfy, cosy, you've got some snacks, a cup of tea or a hot chocolate and I really hope you enjoy the video. So today's video is going to be a B&M gift guide but I also put together a B&M hamper so all of the more like I guess cheaper affordable um, products I put like into one hamper to kind of show you what you could put together from B&M at a very very affordable price and then I'll show you all their gift sets as well so let's just get into it I think B&M has probably the best range of Christmas gifts like they just have so much nice stuff so I put together this little hamper so this is all things from B&M but lower price things I think nothing in here is more than three pounds so I just put it all together and created this little hamper the actual hamper basket is not from B&M I think I picked this up from home bargains a little while ago it's really cute actually it comes with this gorgeous little felt tag to go on the side of it. I love a hamper for a Christmas gift because I just feel like it's such an interesting present to give someone. It's not just like one thing, they can pick through and have a look at all the little bits that you've got for them. And you can also personalize it to suit them. So if they like bath and body stuff, you could put bath and body. If they like more home decor or pets, you can kind of personalize it to suit them, which is really nice. And it looks like such a great gift, but it doesn't actually cost you that much. So let's go through what I've got in here to show you that things just don't cost that much. And I think this looks really cute. I also added in, just for decor, these little like snow covered fur cones or pine cones are they called um these were actually from poundland i think i've got like a pack of 10 of them for a pound and they're really effective to just put in the hamper and they just make it look nice and full and a little bit extra special and there's also some red tissue paper in there as well and when i actually gift this i will obviously put like cellophane around it and then i'll tie a little ribbon around it as well so first up in here i have this very very festive mug this is from the winter woods range it was only £2.50 and it is honestly the nicest mug. It's a really nice size. Like I'd say this is a perfect hot chocolate size. Um, it is kind of like, the, the mug is kind of like a beige colour and then the artwork on it is like greys and blacks and then it does have like reflective gold in it as well and honestly it's so nice like the quality of it feels really good in fact it was £2.50 it's just an absolute bargain um I would be careful with anything like this because it's not suitable for the microwave or dishwasher because it does have like the gold around it so it does need to be hand washed which I know is slightly more annoying but it kind of makes it feel like it's one of them really special mugs that you just get out on special occasions or when you just want to be like really cozy so yeah this was the first thing that I put in the hamper also I hope the lighting is not too dark I really wanted to kind of turn the brightness down and just make the video feel really cozy so I hope it's not too dark behind me so next up in the hamper I popped in this little winter spice scented candle this smells so good it smells really really nice and the packaging is just gorgeous I chose that they had a few different ones of these like different colors and different scents but I went for like the red one because like the hamper's red so I kind of tried to stick with the same theme to make it all look pretty and put together so yeah this was the next thing that I picked up and it's really lovely and this was only £2.50 so so far we've only spent £4.50 okay next I have a face mask I feel like every hamper needs a face mask in it I just think these are the perfect thing to add into a hamper because it's something that they can use and relax and maybe look at the rest of their gifts and just wear their face mask it's just like something I feel like nobody would not want you know they're just so great and this is the Garnier one and I actually haven't seen this one before um, it's called the Intensely Nourishing Glow Enhancing Mask and it has hyaluronic acid and coconut in it and it's infused with it says the quantity of one bottle of serum which is quite cool and this was £1.99 so say £2 so so far £6.50 in the hamper okay next this is a very very cute little bath bomb it is a gingerbread man bath bomb it's kind of in a I'd say it's like a rose gold colour it is actually very very glittery but I just thought it was so cute and like the perfect thing to add in to the hamper to make it look festive and then it also goes with like the mask and that to have a bit more of like a pampering 
evening or something and this one was only a pound okay next up i put this in the hamper mainly because i really loved the shape of it i thought this is a perfect thing to kind of like put at the back of the hamper to like give it some structure this is actually um just a packet of six luxury preserves which i do actually think is really nice it's quite a festive thing to have isn't it like all different jams and stuff for christmas um it's from marketplace by hampton and the packaging of this is just absolutely gorgeous. I love it so much. And you've got all different flavors in here. You've got strawberry, apricot, blackcurrant, raspberry, marmalade, and you've also got ginger as well. So a really nice selection of jams in there. And this was three pounds. So that brings our hamper up to nine pound 50. And then last up, what would a hamper be without a little bit of chocolate in it? So I picked up these Terry's chocolate orange, crispy oranges. And I just thought they looked really nice. I've never tried these before, but I thought they were like a bit of like more interesting take on the Terry's chocolate orange. They just look really tasty. They're basically like, they're basically like Maltesers, but I reckon they're kind of like Maltesers that taste a bit orangey. But yeah, so those were a pound. So that means that our hamper has actually only cost 10 pounds 50. Of course you do have to like obviously buy the basket as well, but you can pick these up for around like two to three pounds. And then you can put some decor in it and the tissue papers in there as well. So I would say like realistically, you're gonna probably be able to do this for 15 pounds, which I think is the perfect price for like um, some friends or like secret Santa or like work friends, you know, like sort of people that you'd really you don't want to spend too much money on um but you do want to treat them to like a nice gift so yeah i love a hamper for that i honestly every christmas a lot of people get hampers and sometimes i do actually like give them their main present but then i also give them a little personalized hamper alongside as well just to like make it extra special i just really enjoy making them so let's move on it's a oh and also i picked up this this is the ribbon that i'm going to put around the cellophane when i do it and this is really nice it's kind of like a burgundy color with gold writing on it and it says seasons greetings and this was two pounds but obviously you've got a whole roll so i'll use this over a lot of presents okay let's get on with some of their packaged up gifts so this one was the first one that i spotted when i walked in the shop because oh, i just love it like the colors of it that how miniature it is it kind of just grabbed me it's only seven pounds and in this set you get a little tiny hot water bottle which is in like a nude creamy color with gold foiling going through it so it looks a little bit glittery and then it has these two gorgeous little pom-poms on it i love it like i absolutely love that hot water bottle and it's kind of got that like sweater design on it like knitted sweater design i love that and then with this you also get this mug so the mug is like i'd say it's kind of like a gray beige a what do they call that? Greyish colour. Um, and it is a little bit textured as well. So I really love the mug too. And then in this little cracker here, you have hot chocolate. So it's just a really gorgeous little set. Like I'd say things like this are perfect stocking fillers or a bit like the hamper and that, like a secret Santa, a little gift for somebody. Or if you like to just get like, people loads of random stuff, this is a lovely gift, I'm sure. I'm sure anybody would love this. Okay, and from the same range, which is the Love and Conquer range, I picked up this candle and match gift set. Love this one as well. You have this gorgeous frosted glass candle in there, which has positivity written on it. Really nice, like especially for like the new year and like people who are doing vision boards and like a positive start to the next year ahead. Really nice gift. Um, and then I love the little jar bottle with the matches in it. I just, I think they're so gorgeous. And these look so aesthetic around the house. So you could actually just like put these two together on the side somewhere and it would just make a really nice gift and something that people are like definitely gonna use. And this one was only five pounds. I think perfect. Like sometimes five pounds like a limit on a secret Santa, isn't it? So this would be a gorgeous little gift for somebody. Okay, next up, these are probably like what I would say are like an add-on gift. So like say you'd already bought what you wanted to get the person and then you just wanted to add a few bits on. This is what I would add in. So this is some gorgeous cozy slippers with little pom-poms on them. They're just like the perfect Christmassy cozy slippers and I love them. 
They were only three pounds. They did have different sizes there. I just picked these up in size seven to eight, which I think is actually the big ones, but I wasn't quite sure who I'm gonna give these to yet. And I thought actually it's probably better to have like bigger ones than smaller ones, a bit more cozier. Um, but they had lots of different colors in these. They also had different designs. They had like bigger, fluffier ones, smaller ones. So yeah, loads to choose from. And slippers like this are just perfect to kind of like, I suppose bulk out a present a little bit. Okay, next is probably my favorite range from B&M. If you watch my videos, you'll know that I have two dogs and I'm dog mad, I love dogs. Everything I do is to do with the dogs. Um, and they have a whole pet range in B&M and it's so good. So the first thing that I picked up is this cushion. So this cushion says reserved for the dog and then it has some gorgeous like dogs down the bottom here. And then it's yellow on the back or I'd say like more of a mustard color. I love this so much. They had two different designs. They had this one and then more of like a navy design, but this is so gorgeous. And honestly, the quality of this, it's like thick canvas. And I think this was, how much? This was seven pounds. So good, like such a good price. Um, the outside is removable so you can wash it and everything. And it just looks really nice quality. So this is gonna be perfect for the dog lover in your life. It's just so cute. Okay, so sticking with that range, I also picked up this mug and pet bowl set. Again, it's in kind of like the mustard color. The mustard and navy seem to be like a theme of the pet stuff. So you have a mug here that says the boss, and then you have on the little bowl here, the real boss. So that is so true, isn't it? So it says seven pounds on here, but actually these are currently 50% uh, off. So this was only three pounds 50 absolute bargain i mean for the bowl and the mug like three pound fifty kind of like a no-brainer um and i won't open it up because i'm going to gift this to somebody but around the bowl you actually have like little prints of dogs all the way around it as well very similar to like the prints on the bottom of here so i love this i think i'm going to put this all together and give it to one dog lover that i know I know a lot of them though, so I don't know who's gonna be lucky enough, but they're probably gonna get all this in one present. So let me show you the rest that I picked up from there. So I also picked up a tote bag. I feel like everybody like likes and uses tote bags. Um, this one says shopping for my bestie, and then it has all the dogs down the bottom there. And again, the quality feels so good. Has little like mustard yellow handles, the nice artwork down the bottom. I love these kind of like pen drawn dogs. I just really like the style of that. And it's so cute, like shopping for my bestie. I love this. Actually, do you know what? I might keep this for myself. No, I promised I wasn't gonna do that. Every time I go shopping, I'm like, do you know who would like that? I would like that. And I end up just buying stuff for myself. Very, very selfish. Um, no, I'm gonna give this for a present. I'm not gonna be selfish this time. But yeah, love this one. It's very, very sweet. I went a bit mad on the dog range, didn't I? There was even more stuff there that I could have bought, but I didn't. Um, so the last thing that I picked up from that range is this tea towel, love it. It says, dogs are my favorite people. And it's just so nice. Like, I really just love the way it's kind of like painted. Um, and there's all different styles of dogs on here. Um, and then you have like the little pom-poms on the bottom. And yeah, this is just really nice. Like, I love it so much. I, like, I love all the other dog stuff as well. But yeah, great gift um, because, oh, I didn't tell you how much the tote was. So the tote was only three pounds and this tea towel was two pounds. Was it two pounds? No, sorry, two pounds 50 the tea towel was. So yeah, I feel like this whole range all together, what is that? So that is seven, 10 pound 50. 11, 12, 13, 16 pounds, is that, for that whole range? And like, what a great gift for someone who loves dogs. I feel like everyone's got dogs these days, haven't they? Most people have a pet of some kind. I started off with this wrapped up around my shoulders, but it's so oversized, it just sort of falls off. Okay guys, that is everything that I picked up from b and I really hope that you found the video helpful. If you did find it helpful, please let me know in the comments below or give it a like or anything I'd love to hear from you. I really hope you're having a lovely day, whatever you're up to. And thank you so much for watching the video and hopefully I will see you in the next one. Bye.